Super Decision MMA UK down here in Wales for Shinobi 2. I'm here with um, heavyweight Tom Aspinall, who's remained undefeated. And um, you got the submission, first round submission there. The first thing I want to clear up, this is for my review. Was that a rear naked choke or an arm triangle, like he said? It was, it was an arm triangle, but sometimes because I've got long arms, I can kind of whip my arm up and get it from the back. Only people with long arms can really get it, so as he turned, I can kind of go with it and clamp my legs tight, and I can, it is an head and arm, yeah, or an arm triangle. Yeah, I just heard him, I was that type in there, rear naked, because from my view, it was like, yeah. he tapped so quick as well. Was, was that your plan to get it, get out there, get it down, get the submission, and get out and go home quickly? Uh, like I just said on the interview, on the other interview, um, I don't really plan anything, like, we train so hard, it's so, we've got UFC fans, Fighters, Bellator fighters, top, top UK and European guys, and it's like I'm training with the best, so I can just take it all in my stride. To be honest, it's just like I just react to whatever happens. So if the finish is there, I'll take it. If not, I'm happy to go do whatever, do the full, full distance. Was there anything about him that surprised you from what you knew about him? Um, his appearance, because I thought he was like a small, stocky guy, but it turned out that he was a tall, thin, athletic guy. So. When I was walking down, I thought I looked in the cage and thought, hey, it's just definitely my fight. And then it was so. I'm not bothered, I fight whoever they put in front of me, but it was just like, well, what's going on? But yeah, that shot me. <laughs> and that comes off the back of obviously FCC. You're like, well, that one was so many seconds, and I think 12 seconds, 30 seconds at FCC. You know, champion there, you know, been a, what, what's it been like this year for you so far? It's been good, what we're in now, May. So. That's five, is that five months into the year? That's five months into the year. I've had three fights and uh, a jiu-jitsu tournament this, this year. So I think that's pretty good for a heavyweight. So I'll just keep, I train all year round, like I said, with the best guys all year, never stop training. So whenever they want to get someone for me, I'll, I'm game, I'm game for it, definitely. And your hope, I know you might not want it, it might be up to your coaches. Are you hoping to go pro soon or is it just keep, keep advancing and see what happens? Like I said, it's up to my coaches, but I'm happy to go whenever they say. I feel ready. What do they say? Stay ready, be ready, so you don't have to get ready. So whenever they tell me I'm ready, I'm going to do it. And um, is there anyone you want to give a shout out to or thank for that you're going to celebrate your great win? Uh, Team Carbon ABJJ. www.carbon.com, www.aspinallbjj.com, the best training you can get. Thank you. No problem, and thank you for your time, and hopefully I'll see you again soon. I'd like to say thanks to you for taking the time to interview me. Thank you very much. Right, it's no problem, and thank you for your time. Thank you. Cheers. Thanks.